There are two officially recognized Catholic cemeteries serving the Allentown Diocese. They are Resurrection and Holy Savior. The other Roman Catholic cemeteries in Bethlehem are church cemeteries. One such cemetery is located in the southeast section of Bethlehem, high on a hill. This is the church cemetery for St. Cyril and Methodius, now known as Incarnation Church. Slovak immigrants came to South Bethlehem in search of jobs in local industries. Believing there was a need for a Slovak church, Monsignor William Heinen of Mokchunk purchased land from Lehigh University in 1891 and opened the church of St. Cyril and Methodius. The Monsignor sold off parcels of the remaining land to parishioners, creating a Slovak community on the south side. As immigration increased at the turn of the century, the congregation of St. Cyril and Methodius began to outgrow the original church building. A new church was built on an adjacent plot and opened to the public in 1906 on Pentecost Sunday. The old building was converted into the parish school that opened three years later, and another larger school building was constructed in the mid-20th century to accommodate a growing population of baby boomer students. In the 1970s and 1980s the school also incorporated students from other ethnic Catholic parishes as the Italian, Slovenian, and Hungarian parish schools closed because of declining enrollments. St. Cyril's, the first Slovak church in the diocese, actively preserved its ethnic culture in Bethlehem throughout the 20th century. A Slovak mass was offered to parishioners until the church's closing in 2008 and the parish had a Slovak folk group, called Tatra Slovak, which was formed in 1977 and sought to preserve and celebrate Slovak culture in the form of dance, costume, and song. The parish school also taught lessons in Slovak, with students learning the language from a reader called a Chitanka. They were expected to greet their pastor in the language. St. Cyril and Methodius was one of five churches that were closed and consolidated by the Diocese of Allentown in 2008, as the number of active members declined. That same year, the church building reopened as Incarnation of Our Lord, a blended parish made up of members of the five consolidated ethnic churches. An examination of the stones at this burial ground makes it very clear which nationality is represented. The cemetery is well kept and has room to grow.